Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Oh, Lord, thank you, Lord. We bless your name. We bless your name. We give glory to your name. Hallelujah. We worship you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, worship the Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. 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 We thank you for this wonderful day, O oh God, that we have entered into. Oh Lord. Yes, Jesus. Lord, thank you for this day of Sunday, O oh God. Yes, Lord. Lord, as this day has begun, O oh God, yes. Hallelujah. We give glory to you, O oh God. Yes, Lord. O oh Lord, help us. Hallelujah. We thank you for extending one more day in our lives, yes, O oh God. Jesus, thank you. Thank you for every sister and brother, those who are present here, oh God. Yes, I thank you for your grace, which is available for each one of us, yes, Lord. Lord. I thank you that, Lord, it is your will and it is your, hallelujah, it is your will for us, oh God, to be in this place, oh God. Yes, and Father, we pray for your grace for each one of us, oh God. Yes, we pray that, Lord, this morning as we begin this prayer, oh God, yes, we surrender this time into your hand, oh God. Yes, Lord, right from 12 midnight to 5 a.m. in the morning, yes, Lord, we give this time to you. We give this time into your hand, Lord Jesus. We pray for your blood upon this time. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And we'll pray for the blood of Jesus upon this time. Hallelujah. That, that as we start this day and as we have begun this day, I want you to pray that, Lord, we thank you for this beautiful time. We thank you for this day, oh God. Lord, as we begin this day, as we start this day, may the blood of Jesus come upon us. Let the holy blood of Jesus come upon us. Come on. I want you to pray the blood of Jesus. Hallelujah. For those who are watching me online, I want you to pray. The Lord has allowed us to enter this new day, the day of Sunday. Hallelujah. I want you to pray. Say, Lord, may your blood come upon me. May your blood come upon this day, oh God. This is the day that the Lord has blessed us with. And we shall rejoice and be glad in it. Hallelujah. This is a time. Hallelujah. Lord, we worship you, oh God. We pray for the blood of Jesus on every sister, on every brother, on every child, on young and old, those who are present here this morning in the name of Jesus. Oh God, we pray that Lord, may your strength come in us, oh God. May your stamina come in us, oh God. May we have that divine stamina to pray, oh God. Lord, fill us with your glory, oh God. May your Shekinah fill this room this time. May your Shekinah fill this room, oh God. May your Shekinah glory, the glory of heaven, the glory of the throne room of God, may it fill each one of us. May it fill each one of us. May it fill each one of us in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Lord, we pray. Lord, this floor in this room will be soaked in your blood, Lord. Lord, everyone who enters this room this morning, may they be covered with your blood. We pray that, Lord, this particular place, this location, this flat would be covered in your blood, oh God. We pray that, Lord, our prayers would not bring any problem to anyone, oh God. I pray that, Lord, everyone who is involved here, who is here praying, oh God, I pray that, Lord, this e this morning, may they encounter you in the name of Jesus. May they receive your encounter. Hallelujah. I want you to pray and ask the Lord, Lord, I want an encounter from you this morning, Lord. Give me an encounter, Holy Spirit. Spirit. Give me an encounter, Holy Spirit. Lord, I don't want to go from this place without an encounter. Please pray that the Lord will encounter you this morning. No matter what, hallelujah, hallelujah, the Lord will encounter you. The Lord will encounter you. Hallelujah. The Bible says that, hallelujah, he prayed whole, day, uh, whole hallelujah, he prayed for, until morning he prayed, hallelujah. Lord, Jesus prayed it till morning, hallelujah. So we are going to pray the way he has prayed, hallelujah. And I pray that, Father, in this morning, oh God, Lord, every worship, every praise we give to you, oh God. Oh, we surrender this time into your hand. In the mighty name of Jesus, we pray. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We worship you, Lord. Hallelujah. Holy Spirit, we welcome you in our midst. Holy Spirit, we welcome you in our midst. Oh, Lord. Lord, come and have your way in our midst. Come and have your way in our midst. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 We pray, oh God. Oh God, we worship you. We worship you. 
We worship you. We worship you. Holy Spirit, we worship you. We worship you. Hallelujah. 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 We are worshiping the Lord. Everyone. Hallelujah. Oh, can we worship? Hallelujah.
Jesus. You are worshiping the King of Kings. We have just entered a new day. And it is the grace of God on each one of us that He has allowed us to see this day. It's only the grace of Jesus upon us. It is not by our strength. It is not by our might. But the hallelujah. But it says that it is by my spirit. It is by my Holy Spirit, saith the Lord. Hallelujah. And in this day, in this day, as we have entered, hallelujah. I want you to open your mouth and speak for this day. Hallelujah. Open your mouth and speak for this day. Say, I shall be highly favored for this day. I shall be highly favored on this day. I have entered this new day. Your sickness will touch me. No illness will touch me. No disease will touch me. No witchcraft will touch me. No black magic will touch me. No voodoo will touch me. No tantra mantra powers will touch me this day. In the name of Jesus, I shall renew my strength. I shall wait upon the Lord. And my strength will be renewed. And my strength will be renewed. I, and my strength will be renewed. This is the day the Lord has given me. And I shall rejoice and be glad in it. I shall rejoice and be glad in it. I shall rejoice and be glad in it. Lord bless me in this day, O oh God. Make no powers of darkness to touch me. No counsel of darkness to touch me. Hallelujah. Pray. Say, Lord, me and my family would be soaked in your blood. Would be covered by the blood of the Lamb. The blood of Jesus Christ. Lord, I, I pray for the blood of Jesus upon my family. Pray. I want you to pray for your family this morning. As you have entered this day. Pray for your brother. Pray for your sister. Pray for yourself. Pray for your parents. Pray for your children. Pray for your spouse. Pray dear sister. My dear brother. Pray. In this time, it's a time to pray. We chant out the Abhrahma Ke liye, Apne Parivar Ke liye, Apne Bacho Ke liye, Apne Bhakti Ke liye, Apne Bhakti Ke liye, Apne Bhai Bhano Ke liye, Apne Pita Ke liye, Apne Maan. I'm chanting the Abhrahma Ke liye. Wherever you are, if you are watching me online, I want you to open your mouth and start praying for your family. Start praying for your people. Start praying for them. Say, Lord, may they be covered with your blood. May they be covered with your fire. No demon would touch them, O oh God. No hand of the enemy would come upon them, O oh God. Lord, in this time, wherever they are, if they are sleeping, may their bed be soaked with your blood. May their pillow be soaked with your blood. May their blanket be soaked with your blood. May my house be soaked with your blood, O oh God. No demonic activity will prevail against me, against my house, against my family, against my people, O oh God. No sickness, no weapon fashion against me shall prevail. Pray. No weapon fashion against me. Whatever the enemy is planning, he shall not succeed. 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 Bane khatiya. Jo bhi hamare virod bane hai, wo prabal na honge. Wo prabal nahi honge. Wo prabal nahi honge. Wo prabal nahi honge. Every trap, whatever trap the enemy has laid for this day against my life, may that trap be bombarded by the fire of the Holy Spirit. May it be bombarded now. I want you to pray. Open your mouth and pray. Hallelujah. Pray for every trap. Whatever trap the enemy has laid for us for this day of Sunday, he shall not succeed. He shall not succeed. He shall not succeed. He shall not succeed. No matter what. Every loss, every sickness, every disease, every virus, it shall not prevail against me. Every arrow that flies by day, every arrow that flies by night, it shall not touch me. No matter what. It shall not touch me. I declare the fire of the Holy Spirit. Declare the fire of the Holy Ghost. I declare the fire of the Holy Spirit. Over every inch of my spirit, soul and body. Over every inch of my flesh. Every inch of my bones. Over every part of my body. Over my family members. Over my sisters. Over my brother. I pray for your fire, O oh God, in this room. May your fire come. Let 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 your f
newer trans families, newer transes, newer trans, new trans, new trans, new trans, new trans, tons of fire, tons of war, tons of power, tons of anointing. Which one? Those who are present here, and I mean those who are watching online, may the tons of fire come upon you. Let it come. You are not grounded well. 
you are not grounded in the word. You are not grounded in Christ. Hallelujah. And because you are not grounded in Christ, your tree is not watered. Your tree is not watered. You need to be a tree that, that is, that is, hallelujah, it is rooted by the riverside. Hallelujah. And the river will continually flow. The river comes from the throne of God. And when you are rooted at the river, at the bank of the river, hallelujah, your tree, your leaves won't go dry. Amen. 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 Your leaves won't go dry. Hallelujah. Thus says the Lord. Hallelujah. Your leaves to become green. To become green and fresh. You need to dwell in the presence of God. And be filled with his word. Hallelujah. Whatever is happening. Whatever is happening in you. Or whatever is happening in your life. It's simple. It is because your tree is not planted. Uh, means your tree is not rooted. Amen. Hallelujah. You have to be rooted. Amen. Whatever you do, however you do, if you do not find that things are not working the way you want it to, hallelujah, Amen. see to it, your tree is rooted well. Amen. Hallelujah. You are not rooted. The storm will take round and round and all the dry leaves are, are flying. There is a commotion everywhere. Yes. I can see in the spirit. Very everywhere commotion, commotion, commotion. Yes. Whatever you do, whatever you think, it is highly impossible right now. Yes. <laughs> Rasa Very Hallelujah. Very I'm telling you this. As I am seeing, I'm telling you. Yes. Hallelujah. As I'm seeing in my spirit, I'm telling you. Yes. Hallelujah. The Lord is telling me to tell you straight away and directly be rooted in me yes be rooted in me hallelujah thank you holy spirit thank you holy spirit thank you holy spirit
And because your soul is blocked, things are not working in your life. Hallelujah. Things are not working in your life. There is a time of frustration. There is anger. There is confusion. There is commotion. There is everything happening around. Hallelujah. The problem is in the soul. Hallelujah. You, you are not free in the soul because you do not spend time the way you have to spend in prayer. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Your, soul, your soul is empty. Your soul is blocked. Your soul is clogged, my dear brother. Yes. Hallelujah. Until and unless the word of God will not reach your soul, you cannot be free. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You cannot be free. Hallelujah. 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 Your physical food is for your physical body, but the spiritual food is for your spiritual things. Hallelujah. I'm you, your success is connected in the spirit, brother. Your success is connected in the spirit. If you don't understand, now is the time for you to understand. If you are successful in the spirit, you are su successful in the physical. If you are wealthy in the spirit, you are wealthy in the physical. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Holy Spirit of God. one step ahead. Yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. God is telling you, son, you take one step and I will help you to elevate. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. You need to take one step, my brother. Yes. Everything around you seems dark. Hallelujah. Everything around you seems unsuccessful. Yes. Hallelujah. Everything around you seems like a hard ground. Hallelujah. Which you have to break, which you have to break, but nothing fruitful is coming out of it. Hallelujah. Nothing fruitful is coming out of it. But taste, but say the Lord, thus say the Lord. Hallelujah. That if you take a step ahead for hallelujah in front of me or towards me. Hallelujah. Saying that like Peter, I will save you from that water. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I will pull you out from that water. I am sinking in that problem. And the Lord wants to pull you out, my brother. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. The Lord wants to pull you out completely and make you walk on your problem. Yes, and to show the people that you have defeated your problem. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. But you need to call out to God. Yes. You, you need to call out to the Lord so that the Lord will help you out. Hallelujah. Amen. You need to spend time in prayer. Yes. Hallelujah. 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 If you are spiritually rich, you are physically rich. Amen. If you are spiritually healthy, you are physically healthy. Hallelujah. I want to tell you this. This is a secret. Hallelujah. 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 Everyone in this room, I want you to get connected. Even those who are watching me online, I want you to be connected this day. Hallelujah. 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 Because the Spirit of God is over here. I know this. Hallelujah. 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 Whoever has come here won't go empty from here. Amen. Amen. Whoever has come here will not go empty from here in the name of Jesus. Amen. 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 In the name of Jesus. By fire by force. 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 Every prophecy which has come to you and which is stuck in the realm of the spirit, I pull it for you now in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 Amen.
Hallelujah. Every prophecy which has been prophesied over you for 2024 and it is stuck in the realm of the Spirit. Father, by the grace of your Holy Spirit, I pull that prophecy for them. 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 In the name of Jesus. 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 I fire my force. I fire my force. May my prophecy be established and come yes, to pass. Lord, yes, Let my prophecy be yes, established and come to pass. Let my prophecy be established and let it come to pass in my life. In the name of Jesus, come on, pray. Hallelujah, rock and make us sit down. Let's do it as great times.
want you to say fire. 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 I want you to say 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 fire. 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 In the name of Jesus. 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 The spring which is around you melt like wax now. Amen. 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 Fire. But I tell you, sister, the Lord has freed you from Amen. 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 Thank you, Jesus. I want to tell you, I want to tell you to be in prayer. I want to tell you, read the word, study the word, meditate the word, be connected in prayer. Please be connected in prayer. Hallelujah. Be connected in prayer. Hallelujah. Because you do not know. Hallelujah. The word of God says, the arrow that flies by day. That arrow is not an actual arrow. Boy, I don't know. No, no, no. 
the arrow that flies by day are the people who are against you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The people who are against your family. There are people who are against your family and that's the reason there is a continuous attack on your family. Hallelujah. I want to also tell you. Hallelujah. Sit down if you want to sit. Hallelujah. I want to tell you. As I, in my house, as I was closing my eyes and I was just looking at you, the Lord showed me two stones. Hallelujah. The Lord showed me two stones. And whenever that stones come together, that whenever that stones come together, there is a spark. So I was asking the Lord, Lord, what are these two stones symbolizing? And the Lord said to me, this is Christine and her husband. The two stones symbolizes Christine and her husband. husband. Hallelujah. But I want to tell you something. The Lord is not happy with that spark. The Lord says, I want fire from this couple. Whenever you and your husband, whenever you come together, means you pray together, or whenever he's here and you pray, there is only spark coming up. There is no fire coming up. Hallelujah. The Lord wants to see fire in you. The Lord wants to see fire in brother. So whenever he's down, I want you to see to it that you elevate in prayer. You elevate, you go one step higher, you leap one step higher so that it is not only spark, but it is fire. Hallelujah. The Lord is expecting a fire from you, couple. Amen. Hallelujah. The fire from you, couple. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I want to tell you. Hallelujah. As I was sitting in the train. Yes. And as, as I was sitting in the train. And I was just seeing you. Hallelujah. The Lord showed me something about you. And the Lord even told me something that your walls are not fortified. Hallelujah. Your walls are not fortified. Your walls are weak. Your walls, the spiritual wall that you have built around you are not fortified. In the sense, the wall that is around you is not strengthened. And that's the reason things are not working out in your life. Because the enemy gets an entry in any point of time to attack you. Yeah. The Lord wants your walls to be fortified. You are praying. I'm not saying you don't pray, you don't fast, you don't read the word. You are doing, but there is no strength. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. There is no strength. It is, it is not fortified. Hallelujah. But the Lord is telling me to tell you that, son, I want you to fortify your walls around your life. Your spiritual walls have become weak. They need to be strong. Strengthen your spiritual walls. You don't have to doubt, you don't have to fear, you don't have to worry because these things are weakening your walls. These things are weakening the walls which are around you. The wall which you have built for protection, it is protecting you, but the enemy can attack you easily. Hallelujah. Show me your hand. Hallelujah. Father, in the name of Jesus, hallelujah, I want every one of you to pray for him. Hallelujah. Father, in the name of Jesus, Lord, I impart, I impart strength in my brother's life. I impart strength. I impart strength by fire, by force. Everything which is not of God in you, be, be exit out now in Jesus' name. Everything that is not of God, exit out in Jesus' name. I declare your walls be secured and fortified. Your walls be secured and fortified. May you rise up to a new level. A new level. A new level. May you be elevated in the spirit. Every fear. Every fear in you. May it go in Jesus' name. May it go in Jesus' name. May it go in the name of Jesus. May you be filled with the power and the the power and the grace of God now. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah. We worship you. We worship you. Prophesy, prophesy. Hallelujah. Oh, <laughs> <laughs>
my wife, if the Zeebo train in our room. Hallelujah. Yeah, you can sit for one, two minutes. We are not finished with it. We have only begun. Amen. Hallelujah. We, uh, and my wife were praying. And the, and the Holy Spirit said to us, so we became silent. And the Lord said, I'm opening your, I'm opening your, I am opening your ear to hear something. And as soon as my ear opened and the prophet is Rehma's ear opened, we heard somebody interceding. At first we thought somebody is interceding. In the way he pray, take a sheet. And the and the Holy Spirit said to us, you, uh, you know what? These are the witches who are interceding against you. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You heard that? When we are sleeping and snoring, see what they are doing. Thank God the Holy Spirit opened our ears to hear that. They were speaking some tantra, some mantra, and it was sounding like tongues, demonic tongues. It was 2.30 in the night. They are interceding. A group of women are sitting and interceding. Where it is happening, I don't have any idea. But the Lord opened my ears to hear, hear this. They are interceding so seriously, even we don't pray so seriously the way they were praying. They are praying against the body of Christ. They are praying against the fivefold ministry, the pastors, the prophets, the teachers. They are praying against my people, save the Lord. I am telling you, you have no idea. The Bible says, when men slept, when men slept, the enemy came and he sowed tears among the wheat and he left. Hallelujah. You are sleeping, you have no idea what's happening behind your back. Every house must have one watchman, not a physical watchman, the building has a watchman. Speak, God is not speaking about a watchman like that. A person has to pray. Somebody has to pray in the family, otherwise you have no idea in which manner and in what way the enemy can attack you and your entire family and destroy you. Who's praying? Once you eat food, you are tired and you want to whole day if you are working this, that. Who's going to pray? If you don't pray, then who will pray? Who is going to pray? Why are people suffering? Christians are suffering. Why? Why are people suffering? Believers are suffering. Why? For what reason? Because nobody is praying. There is no watchman in the family. Nobody is watching and praying. Hallelujah. The Bible says watch and pray. Yeah, everybody is seeing the watch and going to sleep. By right, this time. Six o'clock I will get up. Hallelujah. I'm telling you, I'm seriously telling you. When I heard those intercessions of the demonic, the witches are interceding, I was really, you know, it, 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 it really startled me. I was shocked. I said, my God. As if there are somebody praying somewhere. Hallelujah. The Lord said, see. I stopped you, I opened your ears to hear, see this. When you are sleep, sleeping and snoring, see what they are doing. And in the morning then everything is bad for us. We go here, we don't find favor, we don't find grace, we don't find success. Why? Hallelujah! Because the witches are interceding against the kingdom, against the Christian people. You have, you have no idea also about it. You have no idea about it. You ask any Christian. I tell you, Christians are the most ignorant people in the world. Very careless people. No seriousness. Why are Christians suffering the most? Show me one Christian billionaire. Show me. Write to me and give me this man is a Christian and he's a billionaire. He has businesses. He is a millionaire. Are a billionaire cholo. Millionaire to bata. Show me why. Why not? The Hindus, the Muslims, the other people are so wealthy, so good. Why are we not growing? What is the problem? Where is the problem? Why are we entangled in that circle again and again, again and again? 10 years have happened, 20 years have happened, 30 years have happened. Problem is not solved. What is the issue? Where is that issue? Why is that that sin? We are again falling in that same sin. Whatever we do, we are trying our best. It's not that way. We are not trying. What is the problem then? I am telling you the truth. 
Christians are sleeping very tired, very exhausted. I was working. Excuses Christianity number one. Every Christian, you ask them, excuses they are superb. A Muslim person, a Muslim brother who became a Christian was telling me one day, when I was a Muslim, 4.30, they have their azan, azan list. 4.30 every day I am in the masjid. Shame, shame on me. He was telling when I was a Muslim, 4.30, but I have, but since I've become a Christian, I have never seen any Christian getting up and praying at 4.30. Such a sad thing. He being a Muslim is telling me, he was an ex-Muslim. He told me. <laughs> Brother, ka Christianity mein itna alsi pan hai. That was the word he used. Hum log mein hai. One day we called people for the vigil. Thousands of excuses. One day. I am not calling you every Saturday. I am not calling you every month. After 10 years or 12 years, we have kept this vigil. After 12 or 10 years. We used to do always my house. Hallelujah, but this is the first time after so many years and the Holy Spirit said, even if two people come, you go and take the vigil. Mm -hmm. When the prophetess was about to come, he told prophetess, you don't go. I want my son to go alone. Amen. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you, my dear sister, it's a pathetic condition of Christianity. Pathetic. Hallelujah. Pathetic condition. We have come to such place and we are saying, Lord, uh, soon come, uh, second coming of Jesus, rapture. Are, what rapture? You, uh, you think in this condition we will go into rapture? It's a pathetic thing. That night when the Holy Spirit showed us, see this, hear this. It was really scary. They are coming against every Christian, every Christianity, every church, every minister of God that they should not succeed on this land. Hallelujah. My only, our uh, only purpose for this vigil is that we get enhanced in prayer. Amen. That every one of us get enhanced in prayer. See, many of you have not attended such prayers. Have you attended such prayer any time in the past? No, you have not done any full night prayer. Okay, this full night prayer we wish to have some years back, but it didn't happen as so, so many years went by. But thank God that we have started and we we have seen to it that we'll continue with this type of prayer so many people can come and many can be blessed. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So please, my only request to you is that you keep a time of prayer, every one of you. If you cannot pray, do anything, do something to pray. Watch a video which will encourage you to pray. Watch a praying video where the pastor is praying, the prophet is praying for the people. That will encourage you to don't watch anything which is not connected with prayer. Because that thing is affecting your soul. Anything you watch, your eyes are like, your eyes are seeing it, your eyes are taking it. And it is going in your soul. Whatever you see, whatever you see, if it is not of God, I would encourage you to not watch it. Even if it is something to laugh, something of the world, you have no idea. They are earning money. Are you earning money? They have to see us. We, we are seeing them. The money which has to come to us, the Bible says the wealth of the wicked will come to you. Show me it is wealth. Which wealth of the wicked has come to a Christian, not even a rupee has come. One rupee, I'm telling you. We are watching reels, we are watching this, we are watching that. Don't do that. They are earning money. What are you earning? You are wasting your time. You are accountable for your time if you do not do what the Lord has told you to do. I'm telling you. We are coming to such a time. Now you have known. Now the elections are come. And on on. on June 4th or 5th, there's going to be a result will be announced. Hallelujah. I'm going to pray for our country. If the Americans and Italians won't pray, you have to pray because you are an Indian. Hallelujah.
Thank you. 
चाहता हूं कि आप प्रार्थना में बने रहें अपने मन को Your soul, your mind, your heart, everything has to be on Jesus. If you want to encounter, one encounter of Jesus is enough for you, my sister, my brother. One encounter and your work is done. Your prayers are answered. Your every petition is complete. Just one encounter. Till now you have not encountered. That's the reason your life is in struggle. Hallelujah. The day you meet Jesus face to face, your work is done. Hallelujah! With all your heart, I want you to say, Lord, I don't want to leave this place if you don't meet me. Don't pass by me without meeting me, O oh God. Don't pass by me without meeting me, Jesus. I want to see you, Lord. Lord, as that woman with the issue of blood. Oh Lord, as she said, even if I touch the hem of His garment, I shall be made holy. Hallelujah. Hallelujah! What is your zeal, my dear brother, this night? How much are you passionate? How much are you thirsty? How much are you hungry to see Jesus? Come on, Hallelujah! Son of David, have mercy on me. What's the cry of blind Bartimaeus? What is your cry? Son of David, have mercy on me. Son of David, have mercy on me. That was the cry of blind Bartimaeus. What is your cry? What is your cry this morning for Jesus? Come on. Hallelujah. You have not come in this place only for the sake of coming. You have come in this place to meet the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords.
they receive an encounter. May they receive an encounter. Speak to them, O oh God. May they hear your voice. May they hear your voice. May they see what you want them to see. Not what they want to see. May they see what you want them to see and not what their eyes are longing to see, O oh God. Jesus, we pray. And everyone say, Amen. Amen. Amen.